lot of changes are coming with the arrival of season 32 shape shifting like the whole new ui featuring the new hero chip so i'm here to inform you about all the changes that will come along with it hi guys kazuki here and in this video we are going to talk about the season rank reset new hero rewards and what season 32 will look like at first glance we can see a futuristic themed background with chip in it at the top, you can see that the name of the season will be shape shifting and it will last for 90 days. The theme is really fun. If you look carefully, you can see Chip stealing chips using his portals. It will come into effect on the 16th of March. Next, we have the rank resets. The warrior and elite rank holders will remain in the same tier. However, all stars will be eliminated. Following that is the Master Division. Master 3 and Master 4 will be demoted to Elite 1. Master 2 will be demoted to Master 4. And Master 1 to Master 3. The Grand Master Division is next. Grand Master 1 players will be demoted to Grand Master 3. Grand Master 2 players will be degraded to Grand Master 4. Players from Grand Master 3 will be degraded to Grand Master 5. Grandmaster 4 players will be demoted to Master 1. And lastly, Grandmaster 5 players will be degraded to Master 2. Then comes the Epic Division. Players previously in Epic 5 will now start at Grandmaster 2. Those in Epic 4 will begin at Grandmaster 1. Epic 3 and 2 players will be demoted to Epic 5. Lastly, Epic 1 players will be degraded to Epic 4. Legend 1, 2, 3 and 4 player will be downgraded to Epic 3. Players in Legend 5 will be demoted to Epic 4. Players currently in placement matches or between 1 to 24 stars will find themselves starting the new season in Epic 2. Those with 25 to 49 stars or holding the Mythical Honor title will be adjusted to Epic 1. Players enjoying Mythical Glory or possessing 50 to 99 stars will be demoted to Legend 5. Mythical Immortals or players with 100 stars or more stars will see themselves starting at Legend 5. There is a budging speculation that the season reset rules may undergo further changes. We are on top of it and will bring you the latest updates as they come. Make sure to subscribe and stay tuned for any changes in the Mobile Legends ranking system. Based on your current rank, you can get the following rewards in Season 32. Warrior players will get 50 tickets, 1 premium skin fragment and 500 BP kickstarting their journey. Elite players step up with 3 premium skin fragments, 1000 BP and 100 tickets, fueling their quest for glory. Master players will be able to claim 150 tickets and 2000 BP, setting them apart from the crowd. Achieving Grandmaster status rewards players with 300 tickets and 3500 BP, marking their rise through the ranks. Epic warriors stand out with 6000 BP and 500 tickets, ready for greater challenges. Legends of the Land receives 750 tickets and 10,000 BP, cementing their heroic status. The elite mythic players are honored with 10,000 gold, 750 tickets and the exclusive mythic emote showcasing their proness. As we dig into Season 32, rewards for players who push the limits of their ranked matches are as follows. When you complete 20 ranked matches, you will get the exclusive Diggy skin Horology is my craft. Diggy is my name. Stay tuned for a showcase of its stunning skill effects at the end of this video. Earn 3000 BP for completing 40 ranked matches. Unlock a skin trial pack and 60 ranked matches. Receive 750 tickets for completing 80 ranked matches. Collecting 20 small emblem packs to strengthen your emblem sets by completing 100 ranked matches. Make 7000 BP when you complete 120 ranked matches. Secure 1500 Magic Dust, essential for emblem upgrades by completing 160 ranked matches. Obtain the Season 32 exclusive avatar border 
shuttle skip by completing 200 rank matches. In the Road to Mythic section, reaching epic rank will secure two rank protection cards and Season 32 exclusive skin tag, Epic. Earning Legend rank will get you two rank protection cards and Season 32 exclusive skin tag, a mark of your climbing skill. Reaching Mythic rank, you will be rewarded with two rank protection cards, one MVP star protection card and Season 32 exclusive skin tag, Mythic, which has some more shiny effects. Completing Mythic 10 stars, you will unlock a season exclusive profile name card background to give a distinct touch to your profile. 15 Mythic coins will be rewarded for reaching Mythic 15 stars. Using this, you can grave Faramis Mythic skin if you missed in the current season. Earn in Season 31 exclusive personal profile background, which will improve the look of your profile by reaching Mythical Honor or 25 stars. Receive a 1-star protection card to protect your hard earned rank by reaching 40 stars milestone. Both the Season 31 exclusive profile name card background and the personal profile background will be upgraded, making your profile stand out visually when you reach Mythical Glory or 50 stars. Unlock the Mythical Immortal exclusive loading border, the pinnacle of your devotion and success by reaching Mythical Immortal or 100 stars. The Season 32 first purchase skin is going to be of Harley and will be called Star Magician. You can get this skin by recharging any amount of diamonds and then spending 100 diamonds for this skin. This will be the first purchase border which you can get by recharging 20 diamonds. Lastly will be the name change card available after recharging for 3 days at 50 diamonds. The new hero chip will be available to be purchased for 30,000 BP or 599 diamonds. Also, his basic skin will be available for a grab at just 50 diamonds for the first two weeks. The new UI will feature Chip as the main character. He surely looks cool, hovering with his cute ears. You can interact with him by tapping it. Also, the 2024 Mythic Rank skin voting has been upgraded. Though the choices are not yet finalized, this year's roster of heroes includes Johead, Eudora, Clint, Saber, Kaja, and Kufra. Notably, Johad and Seber are returning to the skin voting process after running in the 2023 and 2024 rounds. We can see changes in the control settings. These changes are now more versatile and give players more freedom over controls. Here are the new control settings. Close Pursuit When enabled, your pursuit will stop just outside your enemy's reach, keeping you safe while on the chase. Post movement at joystick center. When activated, you can see the joystick flicker or move when you press at the center. Turn this off and voila, no more flickering. Precision and control are right at your fingertips, giving you that satisfying feeling. Filter active creeps. Bright eyes you attack with this setting. Enemies are attack in order of heroes, active creeps, minions and then inactive creeps. When turned off, it will not distinguish between active creeps and inactive creeps. Attack activation distance. This distance provides options such as distance, close and fixed position based on range. You can now customize your attack strategy by choosing to keep your distance, get up close or maintain a fixed position, depending on your attack range. The decision is in your hands. The attack assist have been renamed to move and pursue. 1-1 one, one means no need to panic. Not only that, skill smart targeting has also been renamed to accurate indicator. Now when you are playing below 66 ms, you can unleash your skills more quickly when the CC effects end. Yes, there is no need to rapidly tap the skill button anymore. Your phone screen is safe now. The other adjustment we can expect is the nerf on attack speed items. Due to the optimization on attack speed and movement, the developers have reversed the previous base speed reduction for heroes and instead nerfed some attack speed equipment. These items may include Corrosion Scythe, Demon Hunter Sword, Golden Staff, Sea Halberd, Wind Talker, and Harsh Clothes. Finally, here are the skill effects of Season 32 Diggy's skin. Come on.
clumsy new apprentice called Einstein. I have a clumsy new apprentice called Einstein. So what are your thoughts on the big changes coming to MLBB? Do you like the new UI or would you prefer the old one? Share your thoughts in the comments area. That's all for this video. Thank you guys for watching. Keep supporting Kazuki Official.